This is the official weigh-in for EFC 46, live from Carnival City, Johannesburg. And we are live for EFC 46, the official weigh-ins here from Johannesburg, South Africa, and Carnival City Casino and Entertainment World. What a card we have for you at EFC 46, headlined by our welterweight championship bout between the champion David Bursky and the number one contender, Martin Von Staden. Let's get these fighters on the scales. It's time to go to work. This is the official weigh-in for EFC 46. EFC 46, proudly brought to you by BetExchange.com, the ultimate sports betting bookmaker, in association with GNC Supplements, Bear Claw Energy Drink, RDG Rex Diff and Gearbox, AG Mobile, Aquavita Mineral Water, Fireball Number no. 6, Mutual Safes, and Carnival City, with special thanks to the following partners. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the official weigh-in for EFC 46. Introducing from our left, EFC President Cairo Howarth. Without him, none of this would be possible. Our EFC matchmaker, Graham Cartmel. Mr. Jason Besaidnote from the sanctioning body. The veteran voice of the EFC Hexagon, Shane, the Duke Wellington. My co-commentator, Cyrus Fees. And our beautiful EFC girl, Naomi Das. Ladies and gentlemen, as always, if a fighter does not make his required weight, he will have two hours to cut down to his weight. We have a crazy card for you, and we're going to kick things off in the middleweight division between Patrick Luandula and Didier Nyembwe. First up to the scale is Didier Nyembwe. Eighty two point three for Mr. Nyembwe. And his opponent is Patrick Lindula. Eighty three point three zero for the God of War. Fireworks early on. Our next bout is a catchweight bout. It'll be contested at 96 kilograms between Chad Hanekom and Ruben Grunewald. First up to the scale is Ruben Grunewald. Ninety five for Mr. Grunewald. And his opponent is Chad Hanekom.
94.30 for Superman. Our next bout is in the flyweight division between Jason van Emmerwe and Marino Kuntendana. First up to the scale is Marino Kuntendana. Fifty six point nine zero for Mr. Kuntendana. And his opponent is Jason van Emmerwe. Seven point six five, you will have two hours to cut down to fifty seven. Our next bout is in the featherweight division between Pierre Buerta and Barent Ninover. First up to the scale is Barent Ninover. Sixty-five point four five for the BB gun, and his opponent is Pierre Buerta. Sixty-five point eight zero for Mr. Buerta. Our next bout is a heavyweight clash between Elvis Moyo and Van Dam Mbuyi. First up to the scale is Van Dam Mbuyi. One hundred four point four for Mr. Mbuyi, and his opponent is Elvis Moyo. One one eight point four five for the bomber. Our next bout is in the bantamweight division between Cedric Doyle and Gareth Bursky. First up to the scale is Gareth Bursky. Sixty point nine zero for Mr. Bursky, and his opponent is Cedric Doyle. Sixty point seven five for the Dominator. Yeah. 
Our next bout is in the middleweight division between Gordon Rudman and Kiran Davies. First up to the scale is Kiran Davies. Eighty-three point eight five for Mr. Davies, and his opponent is Gordon Rudman. Eighty three point eight zero for Mr. Rudman. Our next bout is in the bantamweight division between Abdul Hassan and Umpi Sebeko. First up to the scale is Umpi Sebeko. Sixty-four, one point five zero for Mr. Sebeko. He will have two hours to cut down, and he goes up against Abdul Hassan. Sixty point seven zero for Mr. Hassan. Our next bout is a catch weight bout. It will be contested at eighty kilograms between Drikas Duplessy and Bruno Mukulu. First up to the scale is Bruno Mukulu. Seventy nine point five zero for Mr. Mukulu, and his opponent is Trickus Duplessy. Seventy nine point six zero for Mr. Duplessy. Our next bout is in the lightweight division between Adam Speechley and Chris Bright. First up to the scale is Chris Bright. Sixty 
70 on the money for Mr. Bright. And his opponent is Adam Speechley. Sixty nine point eight zero for Mr. Speechley. Ladies and gentlemen, now let's take a closer look at the two men involved in EFC 46's main event. I think I'm a lot stronger than Martin. I think I'm a lot physically fitter than Martin. And I think I'm allowed to see my show again. Uh, I think I'm just going to bully him, whether it be I take him down, whether it be I stand with him, you know. So pound for pound, Martin isn't better than me. Pound for pound, I'm the champ. The mental part is, is the biggest part of this game, and we'll see. We'll see him break, and I want to see him break mentally. He's not a fighter to me. He'll run away, come forward, look to counter strike. You know, he's an opportunistic fighter. He's not a fighter. He's not a guy that's going to get in there and, and throw down. I'll expose him. David Burski became the EFC welterweight champion when he knocked out the favorite and two-time champion, Adam Speechley, at EFC 37. With a newfound confidence and new gym backing him, Bjorski is determined that he will be the one to break the infamous curse. Coming off two impressive first-round knockout victories, Martin van Staten finally gets his chance to fight for the title and prove why many consider him the best in the business. We've got two of the heaviest hitters in the organization going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. It's going to be interesting from David's side, though. Is he going to want to stand and trade with Martin, who's got a deadly overhand, or will he actually try and wrestle him, put him on his back, and put him under pressure the same way Adam did? This is Martin van Staten's last chance at a belt. Where does he go to from here if he doesn't beat Bursky? And he knows that. The pressure is on him. Whether he's able to turn that around to his advantage, we're going to see him on 12. Will Bursky be the one to break the curse, or will Van Staden realize a lifelong dream? It's David Bursky versus Martin Van Staden. And I'm coming to try and knock my opponent out the first round, you know. Um, I, I fight to finish. I don't, I don't like decisions, I don't like submissions. There's no better way than winning by knockout. He says uh, he can, he's going to promise to knock me out and um, <laughs> he might just eat some humble pie and he might end up sleeping on the mat that night, so. First up to the scale is the challenger, Martin Van Staden. Seventy six point seven zero for the Punisher. And he, of course, faces the reigning EFC welterweight champion, David Bursky. Seventy six point eight zero for the champion.
I'm here with the challenger, Martin van Staten. Obviously very heated between the two of you. What can we expect? I'm going to knock him out tomorrow. Let's end of the game. Dan, you're sleeping tomorrow, my boy. Dan. Your challenger, ladies and gentlemen, Martin van Staten. You're with the champion, David Bursky. David, what can we expect from you? Oh, well, luck. Like you heard Martin, he says I'm a part-time fighter. All the pressure's on this little man. Tomorrow I'm going to make him look like a fool. Your champion, ladies and gentlemen, David Bursky. And I'm standing by with the matchmaker, Graham Carmel. You saw what just happened at the weigh-ins. Can the tensions be any higher for this championship bout? That was just pure insanity. These guys do not like each other. There's a lot of the line. There's the curse. Everything's going through their heads. It's going to be a huge night. You cannot miss this. Two legends, two pioneers of the EFC in Speechly and Bright taking each other on. A lot of respect there. What do you expect out of that fight? You said it like it is, Cyrus. A lot of respect. But at the end of the day, it's going to be a technical masterpiece between those two guys. It's going to be a great fight to watch. That is just a few pieces of an amazing card. Congratulations on that. We'll see you at fight night. What a night we have for you from Johannesburg, South Africa. Don't miss it. EFC 46, it's going to be a good one. On the 12th of December, will a four-year-old curse finally be broken? EFC welterweight champion David Bjorski sets out to successfully defend the welterweight title. I'm just going to bully him, whether it be I take him down, whether it be I stand with him, you know. Pound for pound, Martin isn't better than me. Pound for pound, I'm the champ. But standing in his way is the most experienced athlete in the EFC, Martin van Staten, who believes his time for glory has finally arrived. Come fight night, I will expose him. Coming to try to knock my opponent out the first round. Plus, a former champion tackles a returning legend as Adam Speechley goes up against Chris Bright. EFC 46, Saturday, 12 December, Carnival City. Tickets and broadcast information at efcworldwide.com.